Imagine a room. Does it have walls? Now picture breaking down its walls. That's how I design, without limitations, without rules. I'm the architect and designer of the Value Furniture Vegas showroom. The idea of developing the Las Vegas store started in June 2021. We tried a few different concepts before creating the winning one. During that time, our team was working across multiple time zones. The other challenge was creating a cohesive layout while still maintaining the individual brand's uniqueness. Nevertheless, we started designing. I'm an expert in architecture and design. Prior to working with Value Furniture, I competed in several international open competitions, designed for the hotel and spa complex in Palić Lake of Serbia, appeared in several architectural publications and exhibitions, and created the winning design for Nelt Winery and Distillery in my home country. I have also designed many residential and commercial spaces around the world, including luxury private apartments and office spaces. We tried a few different concepts of developing the Las Vegas store the first concept was a flexible, fully open floor plan without any walls. I wanted to create a scene for each of the brands, so the whole space could be a scenography which leads the customers by opening curtains from the specific sides in order to direct the movement. However, we decided this was not the direction we wanted to move forward with. With all of the palm trees, neon lights and gorgeous views, Value chose this location to offer a luxurious shopping experience for customers. The Tivoli Shopping Center has a lot of buildings with arches, so I decided to implement that form for the interior of the store. The second concept was more fixed with highlighted longitudinal walls. The space would still be divided by brand and we would have a coffee shop and payment desk area. We then discovered we had overestimated our surface area and needed a new approach. Value Furniture's chief marketing officer says it made sense for the first mainland store to be right here in the valley because the brand sees the area as, quote, another island that we're a part of. The third concept was all about layering space. I wanted to keep both the fluidity around the store and division of the six brand zones, but in a different way, allowing them to overlap. My name is Amina El Kadiri, interior designer from Morocco. I have more than 10 years experience in interior design, something that I really love. big colors, fabrics, materials, everything's gonna match with what they have. The inspiration is a mix between a modern style, an industrial style, a retro style, and some European touches. This 
was the ultimate challenge because it was like trying to blend six unique personalities under one roof and make them appear cohesive while still highlighting their individuality. With this style, customers were able to experience the brands individually, but still able to visibly see the other brands around them at all times. When you see in our customer eyes how much they're happy, the vision that they're looking for, it. so this is the most important thing. Design allows us to experience a space at its truest potential. Without design, we are left with blank walls and where is the fun in that?